New tonight, the In-N-Out Burger in Pleasant Hill was shut down today for repeatedly violating COVID health orders. CBS 13's Andrea Borbo with hungry customers who showed up to find the restaurant closed. No fries, no shakes, no lines, just confusion outside the In-N-Out store on Contra Costa Boulevard in Pleasant Hill. I was just here for a pretty standard cheeseburger. <laughs> that, that's all I was hoping for. I was trying to get some french fries for my wife and the doors were closed. This location had previously been repeatedly fined for not checking COVID-19 vaccination cards at the door as mandated by Contra Costa County. After four violations totaling $1,750, the county pulled the burger chain's permit, temporarily shutting the store down. No indoor dining, no drive through I think it's a good thing, you know, it's, you don't play by the rules. If that's the rules, you gotta, you know, public safety is, is number one. In a statement, in and out Chief Legal and Business Officer Arnie Weinsinger said it is unreasonable, invasive and unsafe to force our restaurant associates to segregate customers into those who may be served and those who may not, whether based on the documentation they carry or any other reason. Customers missing their fix were split on the issue. I think it's a complicated issue. I, I think that it is important to, you know, follow the law if that's been that's since that is what's been put in place. Um, I also think it shouldn't be like resting entirely on the employees to like ha be security guards if they're not that's not in their job descriptions. It's just really hard because I can kind of understand both sides. Um, but I mean, if it's if it's an order, then you kind of have to abide by it. I mean, that's that's what it means to be a part of a society. Well, the In-N-Out location in San Francisco was briefly shut down earlier this month for the same reason.